Chico, uh, we were talking about music in Goa in the 19, late 1950s, early 1960s, when you were in your teenage impressionable years. Tell us about the father then, where you all heard it, where you all picked it up from. Father at that time was very much involved, especially with the soldiers from Portugal roaming the streets of Goa. I see. And especially Pejim. Road Ore, where is our house now, was full of them serenading till late hours. Yeah. Sitting under the trees. You, you imagine that there were about 20, 25 trees on the footpaths that have been have gone. Yeah. And sitting there late hours, the soldiers, some of them having their own house, used to sit with the girls and sing different type of father. With guitar, without? With guitar, with guitar and composed by them on the spur of the moment. I see. Yeah. And it was going on every day, if not every alternate day. It was the first time. Then later the father took different shape. It became in the halls and in the theatres and all those things. But father was father with the real pronunciation and all that. And before the Portuguese left, the father was, you know, like a virus for others. Everybody in the families they used to sing it father. So much my mother, my grandmother used to sing in those days in the piano. I see. Yeah. And that was in time to relax after the food. Sorry. At night. A bit louder please. They were relaxing yeah. after the dinner and the late hours I see. with a glass of wine or coffee, whatever it is. And I learned Fadu by myself. I am proud of it. I see. Just listening. How? To, How? Just listening daily to the music, to the CDs when they came in picture. Not CDs, not cassettes, records. Uh, not records, CDs. No. Which year? Uh, way, way back in the... 70s? Yes, six, uh, 68. Okay. Yeah. No, not CDs. Cassettes. CD, cassette. Cassette, cassettes, no, cassettes. Yeah. Early cassettes, early yeah, cassettes. Yeah. Not CDs, cassettes. Yeah, cassettes. yeah, yeah. I got a CD, okay. And I suddenly got a, such a, a appeal to yeah. sing and the father of the Coimbra. That was appealing me by sentiment, by words. And by my voice. Father the Coimbra is different from the other? Father Coimbra is Why? only sung by boys. Okay. And girls sitting, they listen. In the banks of the river Modego. Okay. Modego is, must be like our mother viewer. I see. Sitting there, listening for hours. You've been then, to Portugal? Sitting for hours. And Modego say it is a river that gives them inspiration. So you've been to Portugal? Now that you're asking me, it's a shame for me. I have been abroad, I have been in Europe, but I have not... Widely been in Asia, widely in Asia, uh, but never to Portugal. No, but one day, the president of Portugal who was here, Mario Suarez. Yeah. He asked me, oh, Rapaz, you boy, young boy, you must come to Portugal. Thank you, for Portugal. You are this doctor, I think I don't know my... But I am creating Portugal in Goa. <laughs> <laughs> so very amazing, you know Portugal, but you not, you've not been there. Terra zone, terra zone. Okay. And for that purpose, I will sing to you this Fadu. Dedicated to? This Fadu is dedicated to my uncle, Avertit Miranda, who is, was grandfather of Maxim. Uh, Mac, uh, the musician, the musician, young musician. Yes, sir. Maxi and Avertino. Yeah, Avertino. Avertino is his brother. Yeah, yeah. So he's named after the grandfather. Yes, sir. He's your uncle. And the father is Oluar Oluarzin. Oluar Oluarzin. So beautiful in the sky that I one day get married will be my godfather. All over, all over, when I look at you and at my village, when I say, I feel like you should come down and embrace me. Luar is a is a star. Luar means moonlight. Moonlight. And anyway, I pray to God that you become my godfather. And nostalgically, I will always be with you. This is a fat currido. That's it. <laughs> Tu és do 
sebe o padrinho Podia adotar da mulher Se eu morrer em casa E terra vira o cantinho Se eu morrer em casa E terra vira o cantinho Mulher Minha boca de fogo